Yes, and while Vice President Harris held a rally yesterday here in Erie, former President Trump was in the suburbs of Philadelphia holding his own. And our Philip Ward joins us now. And Philip, those events go to show just how important Pennsylvania will prove to be. Good evening. Yeah, good evening, Mike. Senator John Fetterman and Trump 2024 senior advisor Tim Murtaugh both explained the campaigns believe that not only Pennsylvania, but Erie County voters will be the ones to correctly pick the next president. As countdown to Election Day continues, Pennsylvania will be in the national spotlight again with many on both sides of the aisle seeing it as a must win for both presidential campaigns. Just this week, both Vice President Kamala Harris and former President Trump continue to hold rallies throughout the Commonwealth. She's going to be able to, to sell, sell her vision to Erie County and a majority of people and voters in Erie is going to decide, hey, that's, that's what I want. I want four years of that. And then no one's going to want to go back to that hot mess of, of a Donald Trump. But it is going to be close. But, you know, that's why I'm always saying, hey, we got to be here. Kamala Harris doesn't really have much of substance that she could possibly tell the people of Erie or Western Pennsylvania, Northwestern Pennsylvania, or any part of Pennsylvania, if she's being honest. She's a complete failure on the economy. She's a failure and she's opposed to fracking. And she's opposed to enforcing our southern border. So if people were looking for answers from her on how she would help improve the lives of the people of Northwest Pennsylvania, I'm afraid that uh, they were looking at the wrong candidate because Donald Trump is the one who's going to make things better. And both both Fetterman and Murtaugh believe that those all-important independent and undecided voters in the end will side with their candidate. The arguments that Harris has been making are going to appeal to those kinds of voters, and that's why you know she's going to carry in, in Erie is that. Everyone in Pennsylvania, and everywhere else for that matter, has lived through both administrations. They know what it was like when Donald Trump was president. The economy was good. American energy was on the forefront. We were in favor of fracking. Our border was secure, and the world was largely at peace. And Mike, the most recent national NBC News poll has Harris and Trump deadlocked at 48% each, with only 10% of voters saying they may still change their minds. Live in the studio, Philip Ward, Erie News Now.